Hi, welcome back to the ErgoDox assembly. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the installation of the resistors. Uh, but before I begin, um, I do need to make a correction. I inspected all of the diodes and I found that one of them was actually placed in the wrong orientation, which is this one right here, switch 313. So I'm going to need to fix this one, and I thought it would be a good idea to uh, demonstrate the repair. I'm going to use uh, desoldering braid. And a uh, soldering iron. This is a butane iron. Uh, made by I Isotip, I believe it is. This uh, this one came from Radio Shack, though, but it is an Isotip. So I'm going to rest the uh, braid right on top of the solder joint here on this side of the diode, and then press the iron on top of it, and um, all the solder should. Well, the braid should absorb the solder, and it did absorb some of it here. Okay, I'm going to use a, uh, a new diode just in case. I accidentally pulled off some of the plate, which isn't good, but it should be fine. And I could always use a uh, a hole through um, if I need to. get a closer look at that and make sure it's okay. Yeah, that's that should be fine. All right. So <clears throat> from this point forward, this will be the left-hand keyboard denoted by this uh, 
writing here. This will be the left hand because it has the diodes on the bottom. And this one will be the right hand with the diodes on the bottom. Okay. So the resistors will actually go on the right hand. And there will be um, two of the 2.2K which are red, 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 gold. And it's actually labeled right here on the board. 2.2K. So these two will go in here. Actually, I find it's easier if I bend them first. And um, so it also, these go on the top side, not the bottom side, like the diodes. Okay, so once those are in place, um, keep your finger on it and flip it over. This will need to be uh, clipped. You want to clip these first uh, before you solder them, I mean. Because if you clip them after you solder, then you might you might break the uh, pads. A bit concerned about that one because it looks like the uh, pad was uh, painted. Just gonna flip it over. Okay, good. I put enough solder on it so it leaked through the hole. All right. Okay, so we're still working on the right side here. So those two resistors are now in place. Um, now we need to put three of the 220 ohm resistors into these slots here, these three slots that say LED. Um, and these are, those look like red, red, brown, and I'm not sure if there's another color there or not. Anyway, so one there.
Uh, this one has some paint on it too. So now, um, so we made the repair uh, to the diode, and uh, now we have the resistors in place. Since I'm over 10 minutes, uh, I might as well go ahead and do the um, I.O. expander in the next video. So thanks for watching.